What's good, SAC fans? I'm Assistant Commissioner Nick Bowman, and welcome to this week's SACcast. I have a bunch of cool stuff to talk about, so let's get to it. This past week's football schedule saw Catawba, Newberry, and Wingate come away with South Atlantic Conference wins. This week's SAC football schedule features Newberry at Brevard, Wingate at Carson Newman, and Mars Hill at Lenorine. In the AFCA National Poll, both Wingate and Newberry are receiving votes this week. Raleigh Aldell from Newberry was to have the AstroTurf Football Offensive Player of the Week. He passed for 71%, 312 yards, and four touchdowns to lead the Wolves to a 34-19 win over Carson Newman on October 15th. He completed 27 of 38 passes as he connected on touchdown strikes with four different receivers. He led scoring drives on four possessions to battle back from a 13-0 deficit. Yodel also carried the ball for 23 yards on six attempts. Case Woodard from Catawba picked up AstroTurf Defensive Player of the Week honors. He picked off a pair of passes and blocked a punt that he recovered for a touchdown to help the Catawba Indians to a 33-22 win at Mars Hill on October 15th. Woodard also chipped in three pass breakups and accounted for five total tackles in the win. Wingate's Caleb Baird took the Astor Special Teams Player of the Week honor as he connected on all seven of his point after touchdown attempts and the Bulldogs win over Lenore Ryan. Switching over to men's soccer action, Wingate is currently ranked number one by the National Soccer Coaches Association of America while Tusculum checks in at number seven. The number one ranking marks the first time in SAC history that the league has boasted the number one team in the nation in men's soccer. Tusculum and Wingate are the lone undefeated teams in South Atlantic Conference play. Queen's Corey Brown was to have the AstroTurf Player of the Week as he recorded six points in the Royals 5-0 win over Newberry on October 15th. He also helped Queens into three game, three game losing skid. He found the back of the net twice against the Wolves and also dished out a pair of assists. Moving to women's soccer, Tusculum is a lone undefeated team in the South Atlantic Conference play at 8-0-1. Wingate is close behind at 6-2. Mariah Martin of Tusculum took home AstroTurf Women's Soccer Player of the Week honors. She recorded six saves and wins over Mars Hill and Coker. Martin is the first women's soccer player in Tusculum program history to record six consecutive shutout wins and has not allowed a gold in exactly 595 minutes dating back to mid-September. In volleyball action, Lincoln Memorial is currently sitting on top of the standings at 11-1. Wingate is close behind at 12-2, while Queens is third with an 11-2 record in South Atlantic Conference play. The Astor Volleyball Player of the Week was Meredith Jones of Queens. She recorded 39 kills, a 325 hitting percentage, 5 assists, 13 digs, and 5 blocks to lead her teams to South Atlantic Conference wins over Lenore Ryan and Brevard last week. She averaged 6.67 kills per set against Lenore Ryan on October 14th. She also put down 19 kills and averaged 4.75 kills per set in the win over Brevard on October 15th. The Astor Specialist of the Week was Maggie Marsh of Newberry. She averaged 10.86 assists per set to help her team to victories over Coker and Wingate last week. She had a match high of 41 assists in the sweep over Coker on October 14th. Marsh then set the attack against number 23 Wingate with 35 assists. Moving to cross country, the 2016 South Atlantic Conference Men's and Women's Cross Country Championships are slated for this coming Saturday, October 22nd at the Clemson Sandhills Research Facility in Columbia, South Carolina. The men's race is set to get underway at 9 a.m. while the women will take to the course at 10.15 a.m. Keep an eye on thesite.com and social media for results of the big event. Looking ahead, 
The SAC Soccer Championships will get underway in a couple weeks and the Volleyball Championship will follow soon after. As always, thank you for watching. You could have been anywhere in the world, but you were here with us and we appreciate that. Stay up to date on the South Atlantic Conference at dsac.com, like us on Facebook, and follow us on Twitter. Send us comments using the hashtag SACCast. Also, if you'd like to ask us a question, comment on Facebook or use the hashtag AskTheSAC. We may read your next question on our broadcast. I'm Nick Bowman, and thanks again for watching. Have a great rest of your week.